Lesson 1.6 Smart command to modify the drawing How to modify the single line diagram and the view In the following lesson are illustrated some commands that permit to modify in a quick way the single line diagram and to optimize the view. On the top toolbar are available the zoom commands zoom, zoom in, zoom out, zoom all and zoom previews. But to work in an easier way, the commands zoom in and zoom out can be given also by mouse wheel. It is only necessary to turn the mouse wheel upwards to zoom in and downwards to zoom out. Also the pan command is available on the top toolbar, but can be given also by moving the mouse while pressing the mouse wheel. The stretch command allows the modification of the length of the bus bar and connections. Select the command clicking on the left button of the mouse, move the mouse pointer close to the end of the bus bar or connection to be modified, and when the description stretch is visible, click with the left button of the mouse to give the command. At this point, it is possible to define the new length of the selected element. Just click again on the left button of the mouse in the end position. Sometimes it can be necessary to select many single objects drawn in the single line diagram. This is possible in different way. Clicking on the left button of the mouse on each single object. This is easy, but you can also select all the objects by creating a box, starting from the right corner at the bottom of the groups of objects that you want to select. In this case, all the objects included or partially included in the box will be selected. The last way is by creating a box starting from the left corner at the top of the groups of objects that you want to select. In this case, only the objects completely included in the box will be selected. To draw in a fast way many identical objects are available the commands copy and paste that allow the copy of selected objects onto the same page or onto a different page of the drawing. Select the command copy, then select the objects to be copied and confirm the command clicking on the right button of the mouse. Then use the command paste to draw the copied objects. All the predefined values of the original objects will be maintained in the pasted objects. Now, the same commands can be given also by pressing Ctrl plus C and Ctrl plus B. Another command useful for single objects or multiple selection of objects is export macro that allows the creation of a macro saving all the predefined characteristics. Select the command export macro from the drop down window of file menu. Then select with the left button of the mouse the objects that will constitute the new macro and confirm by pressing the right button of the mouse. Before saving the macro, it is also necessary to indicate the insertion point of the new macro. Move the mouse pointer on the desired reference point and click on the left button of the mouse. Dock opens automatically the window in which it is possible to define the name of the new macro and save it. The macro can then be imported in the same project or in another project by using the command import macro. Select the command import macro from file menu. Select the macro to be imported and click open. The insertion point of the macro is now attached to the mouse pointer. Move the mouse pointer and click on the left button of the mouse to draw the macro in the desired position. The last command that can be used to modify in a quick way a single line diagram 
is the command properties. Select the command properties from the top toolbar and select a single object. Confirm the selection clicking on the right button of the mouse to open the window of its properties. The same result is obtained by double-clicking with the left button of the mouse on the single object. Another use of the command properties is obtain selecting many objects. After the confirmation of the selected objects, Docs will open the common properties window in which it's possible to modify common properties. In this lesson, we saw some commands that permit to modify in a quick way the single line diagram and the commands to change the view. Thank you for the attention.